the last five years, Gary Recoder was the head coach of the Riverside High School football team. While on the sidelines, most of the time, you could see Recoder rocking a hat with the Riverside logo. Today, Recoder was rocking a hat, but there was no Riverside logo on it. Instead, very different. We've got a Bel Air logo on the hat, and that is a sight the high school football community here in El Paso is going to have to get used to. Recoder had the very new looking hat on today because today was the day Bel Air officially introduced him as the school's new head football coach and athletic coordinator. KTSM was first to report Recoder's move to Bel Air yesterday. The move to Bel Air comes after Recoder spent the last five seasons of his head coaching career at Riverside. Now, today was the first time we heard from Recoder since being named Bel Air's head football coach, and we got to hear about what went into his decision to leave Riverside, a school where he led the Rangers to four straight winning seasons and three district 1-4-A championships for Bel Air. There's a, there's a saying in the Lower Valley, right? Lower, Lower Valley guys, never, kids never die. And, and this being also a Lower Valley school, it, it really, really attracted me. Uh, my message to our Riverside kids was it, it was the honest truth that uh, it was time to just time to move on. I'm, I'm happy with the body of work that we did at Riverside. I'm, I'm excited for those kids and, and that program. They're going to continue to do what they do, but it, it's time for another challenge. And I, I'm excited here about the Bel Air uh, uh, football program and the community here and the athletic programs. I, I just want to continue to add to the success that they already have going on. So Recoder takes over a Bel Air program that is coming off back to back eight win seasons under the direction of former head coach Eric Scoggin. It's also a classification jump for Recoder as he now as he now goes from 4A to 5A, a challenge he is also looking forward to tackling this fall. That is a look at sports.